Um, <coughs> we'll start with the performance from the, from the team today. I mean, it's a 2-1 victory. Did, did it feel better than that? Did it I mean, feel more comprehensive? Yeah, I, I think it did. Um, I mean, obviously we conceded um, an early goal again, which unfortunately it was a bit of a scrappy goal. I think it deflected off chaps maybe on the way through, but um, we dusted ourselves down and um, we stayed strong, stuck to our game plan and uh, obviously come out with a 2-1 win, which is perfect, yeah. Looked tough out there, certainly in the midfield. The battle was, was, was raging, wasn't it? Tough as well. And you don't realise how much the heat affects you. I mean, it's a big change, you know, from what we've been dealing with. I think it drains the body a lot more. Um, but the boys are fit, the boys are strong. And uh, at the end of the day, there's three points on the line. So we've got to um, work our socks off, really. A couple of good moves for the goals. I mean, the first one was bouncing all around the six yards. Yeah, yeah. A couple of seconds. Was it, what was your view? Do, of it? Uh, do you know what? I don't even know who scored it. I think it came off Shaq in the end. Um, but I didn't think it was going to go in. It was pinballing around, I think it hit the post and then hit the goal here, but they all count in it, so uh, happy days. And then the second one, yeah, lucky um, to get the assist for me, it's nice to get the assist, but Rack's movement is so sharp in the box, you know once he gets a chance, he's always going to stick it away. So. And you look for that extra pass, don't you? I know that's part of the, the tactics of yeah. the club, is that you probably had a chance to shoot from distance, yeah. so, so did Christian and Gesson as well, but it's that extra pass that did it. That's exactly what the gaffer instills into us. He always says, look for that extra pass, because... Most teams in this league are looking for you to take that shot early or whatever, but if you make that extra pass, it's normally an open goal, so that's what we've been looking for and it's paid off. And you're feeding Raki Springham, as you said, it's an excellent finish too. I think, personally for me, he's, he's one of the best strikers in the league. We're blessed with Dom, Shaq, Elliot as well, um, but you know, Rax is lethal and uh, once he gets in the box, he's always going to score. It's a great finish again. On to Concord Rangers on, on Monday as well. The manager already said it'll be a different kind of game for you. I'm sure you'll be looking at the, the tactics, etc. etc. What are you making of it? Yes, yeah, it's, it's a tough place to go. Um, I've, not, I've not seen the result today. I don't know how they got on. Um, one one nil. They won one nil. Oh, they did. Um, so they'll be on a high again. Um, but any team in this, in this league can beat each other. We've just got to stick to what we do. Um, we feel we can beat anyone. Uh, we've got two wins on the spin now again. We've just got to keep this run going. I was going to say, how important is that towards the end of the season? Because you're coming into those final <coughs> games. Looks like, I mean, I don't want to put words in your mouth, looks like you, you, you're heading for the playoffs. Mm. How important would it be to get momentum going? It's, it is crunch time and winning's a habit and so's losing. So at the moment, we're trying to keep the habit going of winning and winning and winning. And obviously, when it comes to the playoffs, hopefully we'll be on a good run and we can continue that. And who knows? Go and win it. Hopefully. I'm sure you'd love to be 20 points clear at this point and have automatic promotion. Who wouldn't? Up. Yeah. Exactly. <laughs> Who wouldn't? <laughs> but how exciting is it to be part, part of a team going, going for the playoffs? Yeah, I mean, I've done it before in this league and uh, it's, it's the best feeling to win it that way. Obviously, everyone wants to go up automatically and have the extra summer, but um, that feeling of winning a playoff final is some feeling, so I'd love to do it again. And it's a seven, well, six-team playoff, isn't it? And I'm yeah. sure you'd, you'd rather miss the first game and, uh, and be at home as well. Definitely. We've, we've been saying for a few weeks now, obviously, if we can't win it, um, which is looking tough now, uh, we have to be realistic. We need to finish as high as possible just to give ourselves the easiest running. And the squad themselves, what's it feeling like at the moment? Because I know you've had a bit of inconsistent form yeah. for these couple of the wins. What, what... I mean, it's tricky. There's a lot, a lot of games that we play. We obviously, we had the cup game, and that was, that was a bit of a, a difficult evening, all in all, with the journey and whatever happened. But we had to sort of get past that moment and, uh, and concentrate on the league. But it's a great group, honestly, it's a great group. They work so hard every day, day in, day out. The gaffer gives us so much information with Chris. Um, we're all in it together and we just want to succeed. So um, we're doing everything we can to do that. Looks like you enjoy your football as well. Yeah, definitely. I, I, love, I love playing here. It's a great place to play. I love the brand of football. Um, obviously, you can see me at the moment playing in a different role out wide, which I'm really enjoying. Um, I said uh, most clubs I've been at have always utilised me out there and this, this is the first club that hasn't until now. Um, so it's actually nice to be out there and obviously if I can help benefit the team out there, then I'm happy to do that. Well, congratulations. Thank, Thank you very much. Thank you very much. And we'll have you singing next Appreciate time. Appreciate it, yeah, definitely. Thank you so much. Cheers. Thank, Thank you very much. Nice one. Thanks very much. I'll see you soon. Uh, great. Cheers. Nice one.